Oh, hi there. Didn't see you there. Linda Brune here, and I just want to say my MPS highlight of the year was mass two dollar signs for those of you unaware. Ross McCartney is a legend, and I am hybrids for the hybrids. My MPS highlight of the year was presenting the 24 hour broadcast in case I hadn't, I hadn't mentioned that already. Um, I love doing the radio show every week here in Corner. That was really made my week and I love bringing people in and seeing all the talent that was in DCU and outside DCU and I just love the radio so much. That was really my big highlight of the year. Okay, what about you? Um, my highlight was probably the Battle of the Camp short film and I really enjoyed being part of it. <laughs> I love being part of it, I love that and uh, we love to work together and the screening at the end is really good as well. Um, mine is making porridge with Lily Finley at the broadcast at 6am. Uh, mine is the entire week of Battle of the Crafts. That was an experience. Uh, it had to be performing Hey uh, at karaoke with the great Neil Riley in, uh, in Copenhagen on the external trip. <laughs> was my very first Premier Pro workshop because it's what got me into this. Even though I was terrible at it, I have improved. <laughs> uh, my MPS highlight for the year was the moment we were all in the studio during the broadcast and we finally hit our target and all inhibitions went out the door and everyone just jumped on each other. The tears were flowing mainly from me and it was just that feeling of all the hard work we put in. All the promo, all the planning was just worth something and we were able to provide so much money for such an amazing charity. I don't think I had one in particular. I think as the entire year as a whole, uh, as kind of a collective experience was, was really, really good. I loved the 24 hour broadcast, but also about the cams as well because I'm a big fan of short films. So, um, yeah, that as well. And also going to Copenhagen with the guys was amazing as well. Um, really, really good fun. You got to know everyone a little bit better. So, yeah, I probably, out of all of them, probably Copenhagen was one of the best things I did with them. Yes, so, yeah. Uh, hopefully, we'll re repeat it again next year as well. So, um, I loved the Battle of the Cams because I just love the scene. And I loved being creative because I never really did that before so actually being able to be creative was cool and also seeing everyone else's creativity was just kind of really enlightening. I was like, wow, we're all so talented. So yeah, I'd say about the cams. Um, so my highlight was probably going to Copenhagen with all of MPS and just getting to see the logo and getting to know them better. My MPS highlight of the year would be raising 10 grand for Southside in the 24 hour broadcast. That was the best feeling in the world and I couldn't have been happier and see everyone be like so happy and just so like enjoying themselves so much that made me so happy. So. Um, my MPS highlight of the year would have to be the broadcast. Um, after putting so much work and effort many weeks into it, um, it was such a good 24 hours afterwards. We raised 10 pounds for so sad and just this is my second broadcast and just seeing everyone be so happy and so much atmosphere around the whole penny ground it was amazing. So, yeah. What's my MPS I of the year, you ask? Hmm, that's a toughie. I have to say the broadcast. What an incredible time. Also, I can't forget my introduction to my very own friend, Neil Riley. Hi guys. Yes. We're, We're really friends boring. now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's all I got.